Ooh, welcome to the Joyous Kingdom. In today's video, we'll be doing a paid early honest review on Crypto Cactus Family NFT. This is a Solana based project, so you guys know Solana is all about the community, they're all about the DGENs. So if you're excited to get into it, subscribe to the channel, join the kingdom, NFT content coming every fucking day, multiple times a day. You're not going to regret subscribing to my channel. Leave a like in this video. It helps me out tremendously. If you're not already following me on Twitter, if you're not my Discord down in the description, you are only hurting yourself. All the outfits drop there. If you want to get five free socks, five free socks. I said that right. Use my Weeble link down below. It's a crypto stocks trading platform made easy for you. Have free money for you. Helps me out directly. We all win. The goal of this channel is to instill the knowledge and confidence it's going to take to navigate this metaverse on your own one day. So that sounds good to you. Let's get into the video. And if you're an NFT project and you want to have a brutally honest review, email me at joyageofficial at gmail.com. And if you're a business looking to integrate NFTs into your business plan, hit me up as well. So here's a Crypto Cactus family uh, magic eating page. Floor price of 0.3 soul, total volume 45 soul. Um, and then total list accounts 237, total supply of 419, unique holders of 133. If we scroll down, here's what the art looks like. This kind of reminds me of Dow Turtles a little bit. That's an OG project. If you remember Dow Turtles, let me know in the comments below because that's that's like back in the summer of 2021. That's an old ass project. Um, and they got rugged by OpenSea, by the way. They're still frozen on OpenSea. RIP to the Dow Turtles, man. RIP. If that project ever comes back, they're going to moon. I'm not I'm not kidding. They're, they're going to moon. Everyone was talking about that project. I remember that shit was so funny. And here's their Soul Sea page. They're also listed. Listed here is another marketplace for people who don't know who aren't as familiar with Sol Solana projects. They have multiple different uh, marketplaces here, but this is what it looks like. And here's our Crypto Cactus NFT uh, website here. A collection of 10,000 unique NFTs, and it looks like because I know I know what you're thinking, 10,000 is too much. Uh, they didn't even sell out. We, we saw the list account. There's actually something different about this project, and we're gonna get to that on this roadmap here. So. First one, launch date January 14th, 2022. Once upon a time on the blockchain, a crypto cactus was born from the imagination of a mad scientist, but for what reason it was created? Launch sale and money management. All crypto cactus will be sold at a fixed price. Only, crypt only crypto cactus holders will be eligible for upcoming crypto crypto cactus collections. Holders will receive airdrop and special privileges, 50% of royalties distributed to the holders every month in giveaways and airdrops, 30% redist uh, redistributed and reinvested into the development and growth of the project, 20% distributed to climate change initiative. Love that. They should talk about that more. That's huge into the branding. I would love for any project looking to support any kind of initiatives or charities, stuff like that, need to make that a huge talking point and really, really build that into the brand. I think that's a really, really um, big thing that people forget to do. And that's really important. Minting the rest of the uh, NFTs. This is what I was talking about, the 10,000. So at the beginning, due to the long process of listing only 30 to 100 crypto cactuses, they'll be listed every week. One crypto cactus will be dropped every week on our Twitter and Instagram account. Also, I noticed in every single box here, there is a uh, typo. So definitely get someone on to fix all that because it just doesn't look professional. Every single box here, there's a typo. So make sure you fix that. It does matter to look professional on, a, on an official website. It does matter if you're looking to get investors, if you're looking at people who are seriously invested in the project, these kind of mistakes can't happen. Community management and team events and promotion will be soon be coming to social media by the community manager. Our team continues to thrive and expand. We are learning and we learn from our mistakes. End of the sale. A crypto cactus party will be organized. 20% of royalties generated by the crypto cactus will be given to a climate change initiative. And here we have the team. We have BB, Jeffy, and Soulman. And it looks like they are completely anonymous. There's no links here to click on anybody. And here's our Twitter page. I think they actually do an excellent job building their brand um, and making video. They make a little bit of video content. Even they made a TikTok the other day, which I saw, which we'll get into in a second, which I really love. You guys know I love any, any project that's looking to make content and to build the brand that way. That is the way. That is the way, especially with TikTok, because it's always sent out to strangers. Like that's what people don't get, and I don't understand why people don't like think about this more. This is so big, and, I, and like no one cares. I don't get it. TikTok. Every single video you ever make on TikTok goes to 80% strangers. 80%, and maybe 90% actually. When I think about it. it's 80 to 90% strangers, random people. 10% to 20% go to your followers. So TikTok is a literal engine of like exposure. So any, any project who's not on TikTok, I don't know what you're doing. So I'm glad they got onto TikTok. It's a great way to build the brand. Make sure you're talking about climate change. Make sure you're talking about the things that are the reason you'd want to be a cactus. You know, not just drop the art and say, join our project. Say, hey, here's what we're about. Here's what we want to do. Here's our community. Here's what we're, here's what we want to do. 
now you join it and like you build that into the store you bake it into the brand you make videos about it you make a lot of videos about it. that way if someone does find your project and does fuck with it they go to your page and they find all this content they can consume and they do that rabbit hole and the next 20 minutes they're like man i fuck with this project i want to get into it and that's how it works and here is their tiktok they just made the other day so i uh, gave them a follow support love any project looking to push the push the brand a little bit and see look at this 560 organic views right that's hard to do on, on Twitter, you're not going to get 500 views on a video if you post it. On Instagram, you're definitely not going to get 500 views. YouTube Shorts, absolutely not. TikTok, absolutely you can. And so these are the first couple of videos. You know, definitely they're going to get better as they as they grow and they start to just get more experience and stuff like that. And so yeah, I expect they'll be keeping up with the trendy sounds. They'll be using the trendy sounds. They're going to be consuming TikTok content. Look at it kind of a feel for what type of content pops on TikTok and start to make a lot more of that and start to build the brand that way. And they're also on Instagram with 4,500 followers, also doing a great job there, being consistent, posting and stuff like that. So great job. And I jumped in their Discord just to make sure there wasn't too many um, channels and everything looked organized, everything does. So as we bring this review to a close, what is my constructive criticism? You already know, I've been talking about it the whole time. It's just to continue building the brand, continue building the video content, the archive of videos so that people, when they find it, they can kind of go down that rabbit hole. And honestly, the biggest piece of advice I have is actually gonna be to talk about the brand, especially in the videos. Uh, but to talk about why you want to be a cactus what is it about these crypto cactuses why would why would people want to be it you know like what is it? is there some kind of special utility is there something about the community that people fall in love with like with okay bears nothing specifically amazing about it it's just that the brand of you guys saying we are okay that is the brand people want to be part of that so that's kind of something that you need to think about with making video content is saying what is the branding here what is the thing that's going to make people want to be a crypto cactus and then just like touching out the professional side of things making sure there's no typos uh, make sure that make sure the ui on the website looks good stuff like that code works makes the end cactus so that is going to bring this review to a close i hope you learned something i hope you enjoyed yourself if you did smash like in this video it helps me out tremendously subscribe to the channel for more nft content daily content by the way every single fucking day multiple times a day most of the time if you're not following me on twitter if you're not my discord down below in the description i really can't help you all the alphas drop there make sure you get five free socks down below in the description crypto socks trading platform made easy free money for you helps me out directly and if you're an NFT project looking for a brutally honest review, email me at georgeofficial at gmail.com. And if you're a business looking to integrate NFTs and you want you want some consultation help, hit me up in the email as well. So if you want to see more of me right now, click one of these boxes on the other side of me. Until next time, continue on your joy, continue to learn, and be grateful you're alive watching this video. Bye.